Okay guys, since we're gonna be liking and unliking posts, let's go ahead and create a new controller in our projects that is gonna take care of liking and unliking posts. So we're gonna run php artisan, make controller, and this is gonna be likes controller. Okay, so that's done. So if we head over to that controller, right here we're gonna create a like method, and obviously we're gonna need the app like class that is gonna interact with our database table. Okay, so right here we'll just have a public function and we'll call it like and this public function is actually going to receive the id of the post that we're trying to like right here okay so we we'll receive the id of the post we're trying to like and we'll just find that post and like it okay so we can use the app post class right here so we'll say post find with id right here okay so we found the post and the next thing is to actually like it so we'll go ahead and save that in a variable Okay, so the next thing is actually to create that like in our database. So we'll say like, create, and the user ID or the, the user who is liking this will be called, would be the authenticated user's ID. And the post ID would be what we just found. So we'll say post ID right here. Okay, so we would actually just return the like right here. Okay, so as soon as we create the like, we're going to return it back to our VGS. Okay, so it looks like we need to use the auth class, the auth facade right there. Okay, so that's how our like method is gonna look like. So let's go ahead and implement our unlike method. So public function unlike, okay? And this is simply gonna re receive the ID of the post again. But in this case, we're gonna find the post, but we won't stop there. So first of all, let's find that post. Okay, so next thing, unlike in simply means we are deleting that wall from the database okay so we'll first of all find that wall and we're going to remove it from our database so we'll say like where the user id is the authenticated user's id because it's the authenticated user that's trying to unlike this post and where the post id is also this post id right here that we just found Okay, so we'll get the first result and we'll delete it like that. Okay, so the like where the user ID is the authenticated user's ID and also the post ID is this post ID, we'll get the first result and we just delete it right there. Okay, so right here we can just return a one to say that we deleted it. Okay, so that's how our unlike is gonna look like. So we can like and unlike post right now okay so last thing we have to just set up our route to like and unlike so i'll have a route and it'll be a get route now you can actually do this with a post route yeah but uh just to avoid little complications i'm just gonna pass in the post id as an as a parameter so it makes our job easier okay so right here i'll have a slash like route and this is gonna take in an array so uses the likes controller at like method and uh, the unlike route is gonna use the unlike method like this okay so we have the like and unlike endpoints set up 